I'm going to add another screen layer just to brighten these guys up a little bit. Maybe something like that. All right, and Control S, save. And we can start on our text. So we got Christian. And choose a suitable color, I don't know. Of course, you got your eyedropper tool. You can actually just choose a color from your background. It's pretty nifty. And I am hating that font, as I'm sure you are too. I'm gonna try uh, Avalon. That's not too shabby. And I don't know these other dudes' names, but uh, I've got it written down here somewhere. All right. Chris told me to remember this guy was the one who looked like Ron Jeremy, so that's why it says Ron Jeremy Mark on guitar. Um, so, right. Let's duplicate that layer and call this guy not Ron Jeremy, but Mark. And duplicate that layer. Other guy here is George. And duplicate that layer. And this guy's name is Leo. these up a little bit better. sure those are lined up, which it doesn't look like they are. And we can also like offset these so they're not all lined up the same. Kind of creates a nice look. Kind of separates them out a little bit better. And all right, so I believe this guy is guitar. I change up that font. And I think I was going to use ribbon. Change up the color.
And you can change your kerning and change uh, the space between the paragraphs in here. I'm gonna do something like that. Make sure you use the same settings on each of these. So uh, make note of the color that you chose for their s titles. And you can actually just paste that same color. Let's see what happens if we throw like a devil emboss on there. <laughs> 